The king is here. The king is here. Out. Keep to your own personal space. Singapore is one of the best places in the world to eat out. It's a food lover's paradise. But that doesn't mean it can't become even better. We are four chefs on a mission to create food that's great on taste and just as good for your body. My brandy rice is... Gillis. Gillis. <laughs> oh, that's gonna burn. Taking over kitchens to make classic Singapore dishes healthier. Everybody do set face. Oh, you mean? It's a kitchen invasion. May the Siu Thai frog be with you. Hey, you know where you're going, right? Literally, I don't know where I'm going. I'm just running around in circles. We are now in Yishun, bro. Uh -huh. Yishun has everything, man. Everything? Yeah, the people are nice. But most importantly, uh, great food, bro. Right there! Oh, what, what, what? Sorry, sorry. Try show? The... Hey, yeah, yeah, I see the try looks, looks cool, huh? Okay, okay, okay. Turn, 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 turn. Is this the place? It's the rickshaw, dude. We saw this try show just now. Ah, come. Ming, Ming, Ming. Yeah, 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 hey, yeah. This looks good, huh? Thanks, Dad. Hey, hi. Hi. Uh, I'm a Chef Bob. Hi, Chef this Bob. Is, uh, Chef Ming. Nice Chef to meet you. And you are? Tim. All right, we're going to give you an offer that we don't think you can refuse. We would like to invade your kitchen. Invade. We want to try and recreate one of your dishes right. at your choice, uh, make it a little bit healthier, and retain all the yumminess. Mm. Okay lah, mm. boleh lah. Boleh? Steady. Boleh. But before that, okay, uh, we want to try the dish that you want us to make it into a healthier everything. version. Everything. Try everything. Yes. All right. And we need to dissect it and give us some ideas lah. Okay, boleh. Okay. Nasi ambeng. Tell us more about this dish. So, this is a combination of 10 dishes that are shared communally. The most important thing about nasi ambeng is the beef rendang, followed by bagadil. Rendang, bro, rendang. Chuba means try in Malay. Yeah, Chuba, Chuba. Okay, try. so let's try the food. Now. The food has been calling me, babe. Begin. <laughs> That's the way. Yes. Look at this bagadil. Oh, yo. That's great. Crispy, get soft on the inside. Rendang. With one hand, you can break it apart. That means it's tender, bro. So maybe you could do something like a healthier okay. rendang. How to make it into a healthier version is a tall order. I know someone who can inspire us. Call out, eh? Call out. Sorry, uh... Did someone? Call for an order of one nutritionist. So I have some ingredients to inspire you today. All right, let's start with low-fat cheddar cheese. Wait, 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 wait. wait. wait cheese. cheese and nasi ambeng. Is this a challenge or not? Cheese has lots of protein in it and it helps you keep full longer. Not only that, it has calcium, which is good for your skeletal system and your muscles. So mm. I also have a pineapple. It has lots of vitamins, especially vitamin C, and so it's good for you. Last but not least, I have star anise. It's used in traditional Chinese medicine. It helps relieve tummy aches and your skin inflammation problems. These are just a few ideas to get you going. We shall invade the kitchen. Try to get cooking. Oopsies. All right, remember what's at stake here. The... The golden spoon. Two key things to remember. It needs to be healthier and delicious. You'll only have 60 minutes to get your beef rendang dish ready. So in three, two, one, let's go. What am I doing? <laughs> rendang sloppy joe. Settle, bro. <laughs> so sloppy joe is mainly is a burger, which has the rendang in it. And I'm going to infuse some acha. Acha will add that uh, flavor that distinct taste and also the texture, the crunchiness inside. Marvellous, man. You know, rendang and me, bro, tam ching ho. <laughs> and if I lose this challenge, I think my mother will disown me, man. <laughs> okay, then prepare for your mother's scolding, right? <laughs>
<laughs> so I'll be making a brown rice uh, nasi kuning with uh, a nice uh, dry rendang. And you're being very uh, dismissive of my dish so fast. Huh? You wait and taste my dish, okay? You don't. Anyhow, this brown rice. Brown rice is awesome. Uh, just adding a little bit of brown rice into your daily intake of white rice to help you to increase that fiber content also. So, which one are you more interested to try? I'm more interested in trying Ming's because it's very traditional, which is quite similar to my kind of food. Yeah. But on the other hand, Bob's one is also very interesting. Maybe the younger people might be very into it. Yeah, I'm, I'm very curious how it'll turn out, especially a healthier take on rendang both ways. Want to see an interesting kitchen hack? Cut the tip. So you just swirl it around. So do you see the white particles? That is the set of the cucumber. This is the one that makes the cucumber bitter. So you get the bitter out, you get the sweetness in. Rempa, rempa. Can Bro, rempa, not rempa, rempa. I say it how I want to say it, okay? <laughs> So this is cafe lime leaves and I have this turmeric leaf to perfume further my paste. You think this is what? A duty-free shop, is it? Perfume, perfume all. In goes my coconut milk. Reduce fat for a healthier version, alright? This is actually tamarind. That's going to go into the rempa. So tamarind is really good because it's got this acidic kick to it instead of using like artificial vinegar. Healthy and tasty. Let me show you some of my skills. Shallots. Beef. Ming, my pace is ready, man. How are you far behind? As soon as Chef Bob gets out of the way, I will start cooking or burning. Excuse me. It smells like something's burning, huh? I'm going to be cooking this beef in a pressure cooker. I can use brisket today. That is a little bit leaner and still retain that moisture. On top of using beef, I'm going to be adding tempeh. It's a tasty alternate source of protein for those who don't eat meat. So my acha will add colour to my dish. And also it adds all the fibre inside, so it will be much more a healthier version of a rendang dish. And I'm using wholemeal bun. More fibre, healthier. <laughs> now, let's lay out all my ingredients. And I'm done. I need something to do. So while Bob is relaxing outside, I'm about to cut up this lovely pineapple and make my acha, you know? I, I'm waiting. La. Still, still waiting for someone to finish work. Also, I agree. Yeah. Hey, no, take that, take that, one more. Siu tai, ah? Kurang manis, less sugar. I make for you, I tarik for you, ah? Less sugar, ah? All right, all right. I hear Bob making a lot of noise outside. They say empty vessels make the most noise, right? May the siu tai froth be with you. See? Okay. Siu tai on the house, one cup, share four, lesser sugar. Healthy, huh? Eh? Okay. Thank you, huh? Eh? All right, time to plate up, yeah. And the dishes are here. Finally. Finally. All right, the winner will get the golden spoon. Mm -hmm. All right, Tim here is going to pick his favorite dish. It needs to be healthier, and it needs to be delicious. All right, Ming, Ming please. to you. I have thickened the beef rendang. I've used this beef biscuit. I've thickened it with a little bit of finely cut up uh, tempeh. Uh, 
and I've made a charred pineapple achar. You know, charred achar. Okay, never mind. Okay. All right. Is it my turn now? Yes, it is your turn. Tell Finally, us. Yeah. I come up with the rendang sloppy joe. Okay. Not only that it retains the essence of the traditional rendang taste, I put some crunch to it with the iceberg lettuce, and I serve it with whole meal bun. All right, please have the honors. The rice, excellent. Cooked perfectly. Very nice flavor. The beef is very juicy, well seasoned. Mm -hmm. And the acha is really good. You can taste the char taste. I like the beef. Yeah. Very tender as well. Yeah. Well seasoned. I like the extra texture from the acha. Really good. And it looks very beautiful as well. It's not describing you, uh, Bob. It's describing your food. Oh, it's about Have you seen my buns? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> All right. What do you think? It's really tough. Both are really, really good. Can it be a draw? There is only one spoon. So I'm very sorry. You have to make a choice today, Tim. And the winner is... Chef Bob. Chef Bob. Thank you very much. Thank you. I would like to thank my mother for instilling the rendang in me. But most importantly, the rendang is a healthier version, babe. Woohoo! Mission! I love you! I love you!